G'day guys, how are we going? Well, lithium batteries to run the accessories in your four wheel drive. Way to go, right? Hmm, well, they are, as long as you don't have the dramas that I've had. Let's go and have a chat about the nightmare that I've been through with my lithium battery setup. Righto. So for those of you that saw the, the first video I made, when I changed my dual battery setup, I had a lead acid battery mounted under the bonnet, and then I went to lithium, a slimline myth lithium battery, and I mounted it down underneath under there. Great place, slimline battery, tucked in under my false floor down there. Absolutely great location. But I had it lying down. Emphasize the word lying down, and I think that's where potentially the dramas began. And why? Because down in that location, I've now had two slimline lithium batteries, both fail within 11 months. Yep, two. So what ended up happening with those down there, they would lose charge and they wouldn't charge to full capacity off the alternator while I'm driving. Whether they failed because they were lying down underneath that false floor down there, who knows? And as you can see, there's no lithium battery down there anymore. So my understanding with lithium batteries, you know, you could always configure them in any way you, any way you wanted. You know, you could lie them down, standing up, lie them whichever way you wanted on their ends, however you want to configure them into your full drive. Well, apparently not. So. Let me show you where my slimline battery number three is now mounted and why. Okay, so here we are now in the back of my four drive where my number three lithium battery is now mounted in that case on that shelf in there. Nicely tucked out the way, uh, great spot there for it. And I'm, by the way, I've had all of these out of the, the batteries that have failed. They've all been replaced under warranty. And with this one here, we did change brands, so hopefully that's not going to be an issue. And here it is here now mounted in an upright position as per manufacturer specifications. Hmm, manufacturer specifications. What does that mean? As I said before, most people think that you can mount a lithium battery in any configuration you want, lie them down, stand them on the ends, whatever. Well, apparently not. When I got home after having this battery, because this one was also mounted down under my false floor where the other two were, lying down on its side. It was only been down there for probably no more than a week before it got moved to here. When I got home, I thought I'd go through a read through the manual, as you do. And, um, and here's a Q&A in the back here of the book, and it says, can I install my lithium battery on its side or on its end? Answer, no. I thought, far out. This is while it's still mounted down on its side down under there. So I've jumped on their website and I've sent them an email asking that very question, almost word for word for what I just read you out of the book, asking that. And this is the reply I got back from tech support. and said, hi, Tim, correct. They must not be installed lying on their side. They must be installed in an upright orientation. So then I've had to take it back. Then we've had to move it from down there and it's now mounted here because I was also running out of locations. These are a big battery. There's not many places now where I could put it where it wasn't become, you know, use up space I didn't want to use. So this is now where it has gone in here and it's nicely tucked away. I'll still get my boxes in there, no worries at all. So if you are looking to make the change into lithium, because there's a stack of advantages for them to run all your camping accessories, make sure you do your own research, you know, because I'm sure there's going to be plenty of people that watch this video and they've got their lithium batteries lying down on their end and do check with the owners or they're not the owners but the manufacturers specifications on how you can mount them can you mount them in, in any orientation um, you know can you mount them on the side on their ends whatever because this one clearly says you can't um, you know they're a big investment for one of these batteries and you know they'll go a long time if you look after them properly so that one there is now mounted there because you know the last thing you want is have it mounted in an orientation it's not meant to be in you know, and it has a fail a few years down the track, whatever, and you want to go and make a warranty claim, well, if they can see, you know, the manufacturer can see that it's been mounted in an orientation it's not meant to for outside manufacturer specifications, well, you might find your warranty might be, might as well be in the bin because it's probably not going to get you a claim at all. So do check, guys, because they're a big investment, as I said, but they're a great thing for running all your camping accessories. Well, there you go. I hope that's helped you out if you are looking to make the change into lithium. Do your own research, guys, and thanks very much for watching. Catch you later on. Uru.